Hi. Okay, so the last thing we did was we went ahead. Um, let me get my pattern so I can kind of read it to you. You know what we did? Um, we did. We started with chain one, and then we half double crocheted two together, which means you do a half double crochet, pull one through, you don't finish it. And we cr did two of those together, and then we did a post. Two together, a post, two together, a post. And then you would have done half double crochet around the entire hat. So we are on row 17. Now, this is a new... This is a new um, stitch for us. It's called a half double crochet front post double crochet two together. Yeah, it, it looks like H D C two. No, H D C F P D C two T O G. So it is going to be fun. And it's it's not that hard. Um, let me explain it to you and then you can do one and we're going to do that the whole way around. So we're going to do a yarn over. We're going to insert our hook into the um, stitch, which is our front post. We're going to pull up a loop, yarn over, and then hook into the next front post, yarn over. Now we're going to take two of these at a time. One two, three, four. And so you come up with that. And then we're going to do it again. Actually, sorry, don't, don't follow that. That was wrong. <laughs> I have to think about this. Okay, so we're going to do a yarn over, pull up a loop through our double crochet or our front post. Okay, insert yarn over and insert into the next stitch which is our front post and we're going to pull up a loop and we're going to pull through three loops and then we're going to pull through three more so we just do three at a time rather than two like a double crochet you would do two at a time but a, tr a front post you do three at a time okay so then we're going to do it again um, and we're going to do this the whole way around, which is going to be cute. Okay, so we're going to yarn over, go under our front post, pull up, yarn over, go over the next one, pull up. Then we're going to go through three, yarn over, pull up through three, yarn over, pull through three. Okay, yeah, that's looking good. It's a little bit hard to keep my tension, and that's because of my... My hands still aren't back to strength. So we're going to do a yarn over, go under our previous front post. Let me see if I can pull this just a little bit tighter. Pull up one, yarn over, go through the next front post, pull yarn up, pull over, yarn over, come through three stitches on your needle, yarn over and pull through three more. That still didn't help. It's my tension. I don't know if you guys are having tension problems like that. Okay. Um, I think that's it. Oh, no. We have to finish this row, and then we're going to do another half double crochet post and row. So let's go ahead and finish this. And you can see it's starting to look like a beanie. Three, three, do it again. One, two, three, three. Yeah, it's really gotten tight, hasn't it? And then do it again. One, close we only have a couple more to do one two three 
and that one's hard. Three, and do it again. Front post, one, over, front post, one, and then three, three. Now, I do want to tell you that if you don't like it this short, what you can do is you can add here before you start decreasing. You can do another row or two, and this is going to look kind of short, but it might be okay. Um, so, for example, before you start your decrease rows, you just add another two sets of this. You'll do a front post row and then a half double crochet row until you're happy with the height. Some of you like those slouchy hats, those big slouchy hats that fall down the back of your head. And you could even make it that long if you like a slouchy hat. So we are almost done with this last decrease row. Oh, that one looks better. I don't know what I did to make it look better, but it looks better. Okay, so we're going to pull that. And the other thing that we're going to learn today so that we can kind of finish up is... Okay, so I'm going to tell you something. Um, so that's my first decrease together, and I only have one more front post. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to attach it to the front post. You can see this one's together. But this one's by itself. So I'm going to go ahead and work it in with this one. And I'll show you how. I'm going to do, a f if, if you have this problem, I'm going to do this. I'm going to catch it under the previous, which we don't usually do. And then I'm going to catch it under this one. And then... And sometimes crocheting is just fuddle bussing to make it your way. Okay, and then I'm going to attach it at the top. So this last row is we're just going to half double crochets across the entire top. And then once you've done that, you can pull put you can tie a string through here and pull it tight. So I'm I'm going to stop my video while we do that, and I'll be back in just a minute to help you with the... Um, we're going to make some little strings for the top. They're really cute. 